how was the panel today? Awesome. Yeah, the panel was fantastic. It was um, it was full, which is kind of we're amazing. And we were worried in the beginning that no one would come and see us, um, but they did, and uh, it was amazing. And they all had some really kind of well thought out questions about the characters and storylines, and so it was really. Uh, rewarding for us to see that and just we, you know we're going back to start shooting in about four days so it was a real kind of burst of enthusiasm mm -hmm. and uh, That's really, nice. really exciting mm -hmm. yeah I love that. are there any comic-con versions in the group three three, Ooh, three. three yes. yes all right because you came with vampire and you came with secret yeah mm -hmm. um did you, did you give him any advice or is there really no way to prepare someone for no way my cherry definitely got popped this time it was yeah you can't really so describe it you have to you know you have to he said virgin uh, yeah. It my was um, <laughs> Daniel. No, no, no. <laughs> Jesse, Let's just. I'm, I'm going to say it. No, 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 makes you excited and happy to be here, so it's really great. Absolutely. It must be strange because obviously some of you have pre-existing fan bases from the Vampire Diaries of the character. You were a new character introduced in the mm -hmm. single episode. But is it nice to sort of be able to give these characters a new spin in some way? Because um, to some degree, I mean, Haley's probably going to be a completely different person on the originals than she was in the Vampire Diaries. I think it's going to be nice to be able to explore um, these characters' backstory and their history because, you know, on Vampire Diaries, there's only so much screen time you can give these characters because they come in and they have to you know, do these actions or whatever and then they go out. Whereas I think we're really going to find out more about, well, in terms of Haley, more about her family and her childhood and what kind of drove her to make some decisions that she has made in the last few years. What, like, why would she have a one night stand with Klaus? What caused her to Come on, decision? why not? Come on. Why not? Okay, take why not? <laughs> It's got to that point in the day now, see? So I'll take like, his clothes that, off. Good, that's the good point. Yeah, that's the exclusive down. point. Thanks, Claire. I like it. Yeah. Now, what is it like joining? Because I mean, they had all worked together on Vampire. Was it a very welcoming environment when you first came aboard? Yeah. It was a series of tests uh, that we put him through. <laughs> yeah, I got haze. Honey, the Yeah, I got my hair the toilet. Toilet. Yeah, yeah, toilet. And there's many more to come, yeah. you know, before he gets fully uh, into Haze. the group. Yeah, I'm still scared. Yeah. I understand the ball. <laughs> <laughs> no, I thought he was the coolest person I've ever met in my life the first day he got there, actually. So I don't think that's what you are the coolest person I know. Yes. Yes. Look at what you're wearing. I mean, you know, <laughs> this. Oh, hold on a second. Because <laughs> 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 I'm not. It's on his clothing. It's a necklace. It's cool. Yeah. 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 See, they've been wearing necklaces as well. You guys are about as cool as the Queen Mother. 